English philosopher Thomas Hobbes is credited with being one of the forerunners of contemporary political theory. Hobbes is well known for his 1651 publication Leviathan, in which he presents a significant development of the social contract idea. Words are the counters of wise men, and the money of fools. Humans are driven by a perpetual and restless desire of power. Life is nasty, brutish, and short. Thoughts are to the desires as scouts and spies, to range abroad, and find the way to the things desired. The passions of men are commonly more potent than their reason. Force and fraud are in war the two. The first and fundamental law of nature, which is, to seek peace and follow it. Curiosity is the lust of the mind. For it can never be that war shall preserve life, and peace destroy it. Government is necessary, not because man is naturally bad, but because man is by nature more individualistic than social. Unnecessary laws are not good laws, but traps for money. Leisure is the mother of philosophy. Hell is truth seen too late. It is many times with a fraudulent design that men stick their corrupt doctrine with the cloves of other men's wit. As a draft animal is yoked in a wagon, even so the spirit is yoked in this body. Understanding is nothing else than conception caused by speech. Give an inch, he'll take an L. Dash. In the state of nature profit is the measure of right. The right of nature is the liberty each man hath to use his own power, as he will himself, for the preservation of his own nature, that is to say, of his own life. Not believing in force is the same as not believing in gravitation. All men, among themselves, are by nature equal. The inequality we now discern hath its spring from the civil law. The obligation of subjects to the sovereign is understood to last as long, and no longer, than the power lasteth by which he is able. The world is governed by opinion. Fear and I both were twins. The condition of man is a condition of war of every one against every one. If any two men desire the same thing, which nevertheless they cannot both enjoy, they become enemies. The characters of man's heart blotted and confounded as they are with dissembling, lying, counterfeiting, and erroneous doctrines, are legible on. So easy are men to be drawn to believe anything from such men as have gotten credit with them, and can with gentleness and dexterity take hold of their fear and ignorance. Men measure not only other men, but all other things, by themselves. When all the world is overcharged with inhabitants, then the last remedy of all is war, which provideth for every man, by victory or death. Words are the money of fools. Science is the knowledge of consequences, and dependence of one fact upon another.